what's happening guys? We're out here on Tamales Bay. We're gonna do some crabbing, do some halibut fishing. I'm with my boy Kevin. He already caught us a Dungeness crab last night on the crab snare, so we're not getting skunked at least for that. But yeah, let's start uh, baiting up these traps and dropping them. If you've seen my last video, you know I love using this Costco rotisserie chicken. Five bucks, get a ton of meat. Crabs love it, so that's what we're using for bait today. All right, I got my sabiki rigged up with some squid. We're gonna try to catch some jack smelt or anchovies, or whatever bait fish we can, and use that for halibut. Set the hook, oh, yeah! Oh, oh let's go, bring it in! Jack smelt! Oh my. <laughs> Hell yeah, dude. Holy shit. It's pretty big, but. Hey, we'll take it. Damn. Yeah, first jack smelt. He's a little big, but we may use him if, uh, yeah, if we can't get any smaller, but. There's a fish under us. Yeah, got a goldfish under us. Oh, there's one. Got him. <laughs> big boy. Too big though. But yeah, super translucent jack smell. Tangling up my sabiki. Don't tangle my sabiki. Okay, you didn't do it too bad. There you go. Oh, that's a big one. Jesus. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, nice jack Damn. smell. That's the biggest one. He's hungry. Yeah, we're just throwing these tabikis right off of the eelgrass line. These jack smell, they're coming out of the weeds. Biting them. Oh, yeah, oh, yeah. All you're doing, there you go. There you go. That's a better size one. That might be the smaller one. Yeah, you, got, yeah, you got the hot hand number three. Yeah, yeah. yeah, that's a good size one. That's a little smaller. Sweet. Yeah. Oh, he's he's lively. Another jack smell. That didn't take long. Dang. Big one. Yeah, that was huge. Whew. And my sabiki is destroyed. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Thanks, oh, buddy. Yeah. I got a live jack smelt on. I'm gonna drop it to the bottom here and see if we can uh, catch a halibut. So it's, uh, it's pretty deep. It's like 50 feet here. Let's see what we got. Got two jack smelt on. Now we wait. <laughs> uh, this is our first trap. We got kind of carried away catching jack smells. So this one's probably been soaking at least an hour, maybe hour and a half. Let's oh, it's heavy. <laughs> it's heavy? Oh, yeah. I like the sound of that. Heavy with <laughs> oh. two or three rock crabs. Not really what we're looking for, but you know, better than nothing. All right, hoop net number two. Doesn't feel all that heavy. It's late in the season, so may not be as many crabs around. Or I could oh. be wrong, but yeah, all shorties. Some, there's like one decent rock crab, yeah. but that one looks pretty good. Yeah, not a whole lot. Seeing some color. Yeah, there's a good amount of color, but oh wow, that's a lot. Wow. But there might be. Yeah, we'll see. We'll give them Damn, one, a lot one or two there. measure. Yeah, we got one keeper. Missing two legs, but we'll take it. Nice smell, he's pretty heavy. It feels light. Feels light. That's no bueno. But I thought the one was heavy. There's <laughs> nothing here. <laughs> okay, now it's getting there. See something. Mm, not much. Oh, good. Yeah, not much. Uh, oh, a lot of color. Oh, a lot of color. A lot of color. Keepers, that one maybe. Mm, I don't know, but we'll give this guy. Might be close. This guy's close enough. Yeah, we'll give him a measure. Mm, maybe one. Nah. That one's. That might, I thought that was the same one I broke my finger on. <laughs> uh, I don't think any. Oh, 
Oh, there might be one. A couple that look good. There's a couple close ones. That one looks close. Yeah, we'll give them. Man, they look so much bigger, right? When you're they do. Right at the edge of the water. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know. We'll see. Not, we'll give one or two a measure. Are these guys alive? He's alive. Not bad. Hell yeah. Yeah, we're at Lawson's Landing campsite. And then Finny, come here, boy. The nice thing is that high tide water comes all the way up to the seawall at our campsite here. You can crab snare and catch crabs. So my buddy Kevin caught one last night, a keeper. All right, this crab is like 10 minutes. We got. Not a keeper, but still fun to catch while we're out here camping. Yeah, these dungeons are way more docile than these rock crabs, so a lot easier to hold. But they gotta be five and three quarters. This one's like three and a half inches, so we'll throw it back. And I looked and like the rod was like moving. It's a female, but I think she's, she's close. Oh, she's just short. Barely. Yeah, yeah. barely short. Like, literally by a millimeter. Basically, if it fits inside right there, which it does, there's that little gap. She's short, so if she extended past that gap, then she would be over five and three quarters. But she's about five and like two thirds or five and yeah. So right. just barely short. Throw her back. He like got caught on something. Yeah. Like halfway through. Huh. But nothing. Well they're out there. That's good. Yeah. What do you think, Finn? In like six years it'll be a keeper. 